playing Minecraft. That's what we're gonna do. Alex, Alex is in the house on Facebook. Alex, good to see you, man. Thank you very much for the support. We went to affiliate on Twitch, man, and it's a, a support like yours that totally makes it happen, man. So I'm pretty excited. Uh, I gotta be honest with you guys. We're gonna just jump on into the realm right now. I also want to just check the audio quality of the stream, make sure that nothing's too loud or quiet for you guys here. Well, I'll tell you, those tunes are rocking loud, eh? Oh my gosh. Maybe we could turn that down a notch. Just a touch, okay? We'll see how that works. Switch over to this. So, tell me how your weekend was, guys. I'd very much like to know. I have a multi-chat going just in case you guys are wondering what I'm looking at here. I've got Facebook and Twitch in the same chat. It's all happening at once, you know. I just, uh, I like to pay attention to you guys, so. If you need a shout out to anybody, you just let me know, right? Jazz sends me to the big screen. Ooh. You know, the more high resolution this stream gets, the uglier I get. You know that, right? <laughs> Oh yeah, you did a rage jazz? That's awesome. It's fun, eh? Okay, so the uh, first thing we're gonna do is just sort of review what the house is looking like right now, and then we'll pick something to do with the house, you know what I mean? Died more <laughs> Yeah, that, that's that's my style too, Jazz. <laughs> The trick is to find a house and put everything of value in that house. And that way, if you die, you're not going to lose all your stuff, right? Uh, I know that sounds like wise, like, oh, you could do that. Yeah, but I screw that up all the time. Uh, you know, it's so, uh, you know. You and me are bored of regularities. Living all the dreams, playing all the games, and getting high on love. I'm gonna turn this down just a notch there. They can chase us down, but we will always win. Trying to balance this out here, guys. I don't like messing with my settings too much. For the most part, it's I got it pretty solid, you know. Yeah, Jazz, if you're stinky with the, uh, the sort of the, the illager curse, you know, that'll get it. Other than that, they just kind of bumble in, right? Yep. That's exactly how it works, Jazz. Good morning. Hey, good morning, Muddy. Looks like we're not going to get to sleep here. That's okay. I'll take a look around this house right now. Jazz, I have triggered many, many raids because I'm all stinky and I don't think, I think that I, I can get a little close to the village, but I, I get, basically if you go anywhere near a village, it just triggers it, right? So, best thing to do is uh, what Madi always says is always have a bucket of milk on you and drink that milk and then you won't be stinky, right? See, I love this platform up here, guys. This is just so nice. And let the colors rain. It's going to be a really cool place to hang out, just up here. Also need to make a nice little dock for fishing. I was going to make a bridge to there and then a dock off of there. Just so it's fun, you know what I mean? That's the plan anyways, we'll see how that works. Yeah, love this platform up here. We're going to need some underground farms very, very soon. Let's go downstairs and just take a look at those uh, underground farms. Uh, Alex uh, says hi, Maddie, from Facebook. There. Hi, Alex. Yeah. I was busy watching your commercial on your new affiliated Twitch account. <laughs> oh yeah, right on. <laughs> 
Right on. Yeah, there um there's ways to customize those a little bit. Uh, there's a way to actually turn them off and then you trigger them throughout your stream. Uh, I don't know how to do that. I don't really. I'm not a fan of ads. Um, so I'd actually like to minimize that if possible. Uh, for you guys and myself, I you know I'm personally not in love with ads. All my YouTube content, uh, I, I upload all my past streams to YouTube, and uh, I don't put any ads on those. I mean, you know, YouTube's got enough ads; they don't need more. You know what I mean? Oh, Matt is in bed. Okay, I'll run upstairs and get in the bed. I I was standing there for the longest time watching the concert. <laughs> was it a good one? <laughs> oh, water broke for breakfast. Oh, lovely. <laughs> this would be great, guys. If you are new to the stream, say hi in the chat, please. Uh, we love meeting people around here, and I do mean we. From the people in the realm and then all the other sh uh, chat, uh, crazy people in the chat, you know, we all just love talking to each other, so don't be shy. You can always say hi. The bed thing is not working out. I think maybe uh, Ace is not. Maybe this, um, although it comes with keyboard or something. Okay. And if you ever can't hear me good, let me know because I think my phone picks it up. Miku says to make a uh, glass fence on the balcony. That could be nice. That could be nice, very modern, right? And I see Ace's little arrow and it's not moving at all, so he's probably... <laughs> AFK, maybe? Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's all right. That's all right. Okay, so this is looking good. All right, all right, so take a look at this, guys. You see this spruce tree here needs five by five, and this seems like it's encroaching on it. This one won't pop because this tree exists is probably what's gonna happen here. So I might actually knock these out and put oak trees instead of these ones. And change this crop to oak. Let's give it a try. Try lowering your spruce trees one block. The little, the whole little nine patch. Yeah, that's that was a really good idea, Muddy. I'm, what I'm gonna do is what I have right now, the setup right now, and I'm gonna just see if it works. And if it doesn't, that's the next step for sure. See, I don't think that a K tree—is that how you say that? I don't think that's close enough to hurt it. I, I think it is. You see here, do you? and it's supposed to be like a picture of five by five column going all the way to the top. It has to have that room all the way, right? And so this, okay. like this stuff here, sitting sort of near it, I'm just... Okay, so try this before you knock that, take, before you totally remove that tree, just try just your center spruce tree, take the other ones out. Oh, and... And grow just one, see if you can grow one spruce tree right in the middle. Well, they'll, this one in the middle here, it'll pop, but then there's these ones here. I think I gave them enough space. It's too... It's, I think you did too. Yeah, it looks really well spaced out. So I think if I'm having problems with this at all, it's that you're right. It needs to sink down a, a notch. It needs to be just to give it a little more height, right? Um, mm -hmm. I want to give it some time, though, because I just set this up last time I was playing. And so... Hey, throw some bone meal on them. Uh, yeah, I do have a hilarious amount of bone thank you, thanks to you. <laughs> <laughs> an obscene amount of bone, really. <laughs> I've turned it all into bone blocks, and I have a billion of them. <laughs> I think you, want, you can start a dog food company with all the ash and bone that you have now. All right, we're switching this to an oak. Um, we're switching those to oak trees, for sure. Just to get that right. I'll tear this down. Oh, Alex is having glitchy troubles. I'm 
So the Twitch uh, show you an ad thing is something like for every 1,000 views of the ad, you get three bucks. <laughs> yeah, cha-ching, right? <laughs> it's pretty intense. Uh, it is part of the affiliate sort of uh, shindig, though, so... We're, 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 we're going to work it all out. We're going to work out how, how it all works. Dark Oak here. What is this? There's the Acacia. Okay. Yeah, it's looking good though. I'm actually really liking it. And I know this will work for Oak. I'm not worried about that at all. Alright, good enough for now. Oh, the sword with fire aspect is the way to go. There we go, jeez. Lovely. I've often felt that if you walk on seedlings or crops, uh, it should slow the growth down, just like in real life. Well, if you, if you run on them and stomp on them, then it does. Really? Yeah. Like yeah. for real? I was like thought go, that. Go stand in your garden and jump up and down. Yeah, <laughs> I'd rather not. <laughs> Crazy cows. There you go. So, Madi, what do you say we change up the texture pack in a couple streams or so? Just for fun. That's fine with me. Yeah, okay. I was I think it's I think it's fun to see all the different ones. For sure. For sure, I was just, uh, I was watching one of my past streams there, just looking at a couple little clips from it, and, uh, it is, it was Jollycraft, and I was like, oh, we really should just do the Jollycraft thing, you know, like, yeah. just to see. I do love it, so. I bought a bunch of texture packs once. I was being a silly grandma, because I'm a grandma, everyone. 
<laughs> and my kid, my grandkids that I play with, I made them each a world the seed. I put in their birthday, their oh, birthday, wow. birthday month, year, and then I bought them each a texture pack that I thought reminded me of them. <laughs> right on. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't know you could. The birthday date is the same length as a seed number. Does it, um, does it work that way? Well, you, yeah, you can put a seed in and call it zero. It might turn it into something else, but... Oh, okay, so just any old number like, generates something, I guess, right? Right, right. That's kind of... So I did not put, know you that. You can put in a word, like put in, make one and put in your daughter's name or or your wife's name. or And I might have done that. I might have done their birthday or their name now. Right it's on. And all of that is in... Um, not bedrock, but and not Java beta. Yeah. And we don't have the beta anymore. Well, we have it, but it's like ridiculously it, um, crazy to, to switch back and forth. So we've never done that. But but I thought it was fun. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds great. Why? Why, kitty kitty? So I think I want a netherrack roof. And I'm going to have to go into the nether and uh, do some serious roof. work. Yep. Red brick. Um, we have a lot of that. Or at least some nether netherrack from making all our tunnels and stuff. And I can start baking it for you if that's what you would like. Well, I got, uh, I'm going to give it a try right now. Just go over to the portal that's made near the, near the home here and, uh, just sort of see. Just sort of see. Let's see if I have easy access to it or not. Let's go to the nether, guys. Let's just take a quick look. Although, I don't have any armor at all. Maybe I'm going to craft a little bit of armor first. Do you know if you can put mending on uh, chest armor or leggings? Yes, you can put mending yeah. on all your armor. Okay. Because I have 30 diamonds. Maybe it's finally time to craft a little bit of proper armor. Oh, you have enough diamonds to do that. And then if you don't put mending on it, we can um, enchant it. And get, you know, see what kind of enchantments we can get on them. Oh, and then put the mending on. Uh-huh. Right, okay. All right, well, I'll give this a try here. Because mending won't make it any more protected for you if you just have mending. Right, right. Maybe I'll come by. I'll come by your place. Let's see what we can do on this. Oh, there's all kinds of stuff to see over here. Oh yeah. <laughs> Did you glass over my chasm? <laughs> Did you see? You just now saw that. <laughs> it's totally yes. safety now. Yes, I did. <laughs> <laughs> you can remove it, and I'm sure you will, but I fixed it for me. <laughs> <laughs> Jazz is asking, how do you get mending? Um, Madi has been buying it from a villager. Uh, other than that, you can get lucky with fishing. You can fish up a mending book. Oh, uh, Royal is my first sub. Thanks, buddy. Right on, man. I'll get I'll I'll get to work on making that a very special thing for you. I got a subscriber on Twitch. Yeah, I feel uh, I feel like my life is complete. 
Jazz, there is a chance of you getting it on an enchanting table, but it's not a guarantee. No, I've never oh. seen mending on an enchanting table. No? I no. Guess it's, I guess it's not impossible, but I've never, ever, ever seen it. But I'm nobody, and I know nothing. Yes, Alex, we're just going to uh, pop over to Maudie's house, uh, check out the enchantment table to, um, I, I want to get some armor going on, and especially want mending on a piece of uh, diamond armor, um, just so I never have to repair the damn thing again, right? <laughs> but I'm only at 27, but I, w I can do it to 30 really quickly. I've got level 9 here, and we'll just sort of see how that works. <laughs> Let's see, oh if, see if I can get anything, you know, get something. You can stand at the skelly spawner and get yourself up to 32. Wow, this is so awesome. Keep going straight. Yep, I got it here. I am blown away. That one leads to purple koala. That's her mushroom. Black. I am so blown away, you guys. <laughs> this looks amazing. Okay, look at... Go, don't go through there yet. Look behind. Oh, no. It's, oh, there we go. Yeah, go through the gate. Look, look over this way. Oh, wow, look no, at that. Yeah, through the gates. Yeah, if you go through that one... There's a fortress there. Mm -hmm. On the back of that portal is the tower that we made going up to the top of the nether. Oh, wow. This is intense. And on the other side of that is the portal to... Um, a poisonous Taco. That's his with the C C A C L. Oh yeah, okay. Minecraft name. Hey, and Cindy. Then that, yeah, and then behind that is the portal to my mind. He made one to my mind. It has a pickaxe on the flag. And then and you also you've got to go up that. Hmm, I'm seeing thorns one, unbreaking two, and projectile protection four. Yeah, don't do that. Mm. I'm, I'm at 28, almost to 29, and I can get you something with um, level 30. As soon as I get a few more skellies. <laughs> I'm starting to think that these uh, these pigs you've got trapped in your house are not. Not as decorative as you might want. You might want to get rid of these guys. I don't know, I can't... They, they look disgusting, and they're not happy. <laughs> I, tried to, I tried to move them to a more cozier spot, and they did not cooperate at all. I believe you. Yeah. It was so frustrating, I could have... I've been staying in your little corner. You know what? One came down through the mine shaft, too, so I've got one down there. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm still walking around with your lapis block here. Royal things are good, man. Uh, the world's gone a little crazy with uh, the whole itis thing going around, so some people are at work, some people are not, you know what I mean? Sunid, I don't know why she keeps the zombies in her house. I guess because they're here. It's, it's interesting that they're somewhere out in the real world and, you know. But uh, they're not they great pets. Wanted to be there. They came through the portal. I came out one day, and they were like, "Hello, zombie pigmen in my living." So I fenced <laughs> them in, so they wouldn't wander around and scare my sheep and my cows. We're gonna take a little They're screenshot happy. here. I tried to move them, and when I moved them, they kept going back to that. I couldn't get them to move to the spot I wanted. They kept going back to their corner like they were bonded with it or something weird. <laughs> oh, is it nighttime? I do have a bed down here.
why not kill them, Sunid? I uh, I think it's it, I think it's an experiment. I think it's like a scientific experiment. <laughs> yeah, Royal, I do have some emote ideas. Uh, I'm gonna sit down with uh, the good old Photoshop or some other editor soon and uh, come up with some good uh, some good stuff. I was thinking of keeping an archaeology theme, but maybe not. Oh, we we'll can't see. go to bed. Ace is not alive. No, oh, no. I'm down the chute at this down spot. Cleaning out my tree farm right now. Wow, well, the skeletons stack up. Hmm. Wonder if there's a way for me to boot an inactive player. Oh my gosh, Madi, your cats are ridiculous. <laughs> are they bugging you? They're they're by your uh They're by there's little Mrs. By bed, bed basically. Yeah, and they're just yeah. so cute. They're ridiculous. They're looking at there's me. There's one more down below, a little orange tabby, but I saw a brown one over in the village. So I'm keeping some fish on me so I can catch it. Come on, where are all the skeletons? It's like stopped coming. Just give me one chance. Wow, uh, just beautiful, Madi. I can't believe what I'm looking at. I'm up on the tower looking around here, and uh, you've done a lot of really nice work. I assume your village is healthy now? Um, I have three villagers. I haven't let them out yet. Probably for the best. Yeah. I want to put a fence around their little yard. Come downstairs and look out the back gate, out the patio. I made a barn, and you'll have to go see my bee house. Oh, look at this! No love it. So nice. I love it for sure. Hey, Bruce. Good to see you, man. Yeah, Jazz, isn't this great? There's multicolored sheep the going top, on in here. Lots of the barn, and I'm going to put some. This is truly psychedelic sheep going on here. Like it's, this is very. If I could play Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds right now for this stream, the sheep stream, I would. The magenta one it changes color. Oh, there he is right here. <laughs> A sheep of many, sheep of many colors. <laughs> <laughs> Jazz is asking how much time it took. Only a couple hours. Uh, Maddy, really, she's barely played at all, so... For all of for this. Which? For everything. <laughs> um, you know, I did spend a little bit at a time because I had to cook the glass and I had to... Hey, there's the giant taco gamer. Hi, taco. Hey. Yeah, we've got two tacos now. We've got Poisonous Taco and Giant Taco Gamer is a, a special guest today, a special viewer today. <laughs> I have a tropical fish pond over here. So nice. Look at this. If you want that um, achievement, go to the top of that. Oh, I'm going to... Madi, 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 Madi. Never trust I will me. die. <laughs> I will do that when, I'm, to do it, right? when I'm totally naked. I will do that. Okay. But I will if not be have any of my gear on me when I'm doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Guaranteed and then if you disaster. Go to like number one, number two hundred, level hundred, and then just step gently off. You'll land on the the slime blocks, and you'll get the bouncing ninety blocks up in the air. <laughs> okay, my bee habitat is this way. That's my bamboo, or my what is that? 
sugarcane farm, my vine farm. Oh yeah, and my looking great. Farm. Looks awesome. I did not know the vines would grow like that, or it's, it grows that big. Yeah, I got that from someone I saw. Oh, this looks so nice, Marty. It's amazing. <laughs> Bruce says it's a trap. Don't do the jump thing. <laughs> it worked. It worked for ta poisonous taco. Okay, go up this huh? scaffolding. You can go up this one. This looks uh, safe. It is. It's scary, and it's not it's high even if you one? fall. But then when you come down, jump onto the honey, and you'll slide down the honey and get in the honey. Sliding down honey is meant. Look at you slide down that honey. I did it. I didn't get any achievements though. Let's try it again. You will. It takes a sec. Yeah, it just takes a second. Oh yeah. Okay. Ah. ah! Okay. Or you fall and. Yeah, I think my butt stuck to it at the last second there. <laughs> yep, yeah, absolutely stunning, Muddy. It's amazing. I brought one diamond chest plate over here, but I did bring the rest of my diamonds. Um, let's go give that enchantment thing a try. Because I am really sick of... I have a hat and some boots on right now. And they're gold. It's not even, like, iron. Like, it, it's pretty pathetic. Well, even if you wear your diamond armor unenchanted, you'll be better protected than... That's true. That's true. I, I don't want to, um... I, I'm really hoping to get mending. I'll use that mending book that you gave me on it. And that way, uh... Yeah. That way I, I won't have to spend any diamonds to fix it. So let me just hand this to you. Something like that. Do you have the lapis? There it is. And I can get you... I'm only level 28. I could get you something better if I was... <laughs> so I'll tell you first. Right now I can get you blast protection two. If we wait till thirty, I can get you fire protection three. Mm, I don't know. What do you think? To be honest, I uh, would wait. I would wait because I'm so close. Yeah. I mean, give me five minutes and I'll be level thirty. Fire protection is definitely the best, especially level three. Okay, like let level me, four. Let me, if you, sorry. You keep talking. I'm going down really fast to the skeleton spawner. Giant taco, uh, just so you know, uh, it, I think there is some secret rooms in this house, but I don't think she'll tell us on stream. <laughs> it is, it's not a public realm, it's a private realm. I, we, we invite people directly into it, and there's only 10 players maximum, so it's a very small realm in that sense. Um, but uh, still, best to just keep that one quiet, you know, the secret stuff, right? Yeah. Oh, Royal, the life of a streamer, eh, man? You're getting, you're getting like bots, which is really weird. Uh, I've not yet seen a Twitch bot of any kind. Uh, yeah, none of that, you know? Just some high quality friends kind of thing is all that comes and goes from here. Yeah, Bruce, I'd love to see the house, man. You guys are light years ahead of where I'm at. Like, just. I'm still well, trying to get a roof on my house. While you're waiting for me, you should go look at CA Taco. CA Taco, I get his name all the time. Go look at his house. Oh yeah, okay. He's got some really cool machine. I have some a few automatic farms in my basement. Ooh. And I have a pretty effective chicken cooking hatching machine it's a little different than tacos but um ace made it for me nice so you have like a kentucky fried chicken in your house it's basically what it is <laughs> well it's over by the um, bee habitat oh purple panda did she did she get on 
I mean koala. I, you're so close to her house, but she's not on, so. It's a little fairy dream. You would like it. She's been working on a castle. The stem the stone things that I'm working on. I'm following you. The big, this big stone thing is just a farm that I'm working on right now. I'm trying to make it look as nice as possible, but <laughs> it you should looks come like through the nether. <laughs> giant stone uh, mushroom. Oh yeah, I'm yeah. coming in. Look at this. This is a slipper layer. Second layer is gonna have furnaces and stuff. Then the next layer is my is the room with my bedroom in it. <laughs> right on. Look at this. Love it. And then uh my my basement's kinda hidden. It's down here. All the way down, and then there's a little hole down. Oh, there. I love it! Wow, that's cool. And then this is where all my farms are. Okay, okay, you guys. <laughs> I'm amazed. I'm absolutely amazed. So much talent. Where are the amazing screenshots for the Discord group to see this stuff, you guys? You, you have a lot to show off here. You have a lot to show off here. You should post it on the uh, Facebook uh, group or post it on, um, yeah, on uh, the Discord, of course, you know? Like, totally want to be able to see this stuff. Chicken thing is weird. It's a bunch of chickens with lava floating over top of them. No, the and babies the, go in there. the chickens is in this one. Yeah, and the ba they go in as babies, and when they grow up, okay. then they hit the lava. Oh. And <laughs> it's nothing cruel about that. And then, and then this is back here, just my little AFK room. Alex, I know it's very late, man. Thanks very much for popping in and watching. If you need hey, to Alex. check out, you do it. We'll see you soon, man. So need you too, if you're from around there, man. I know it's late at night. Yeah, I am amazed, guys. This is absolutely amazing. All right, I'm going to pop back to Madi's house here. Some bees, some beady craft bees going on. Very nice. Yeah, we need to make a bridge over that mountain from my place to yours. Yeah, you guys could use something like something to just easily walk between it. Have you ever collected honey from beehives? No, no, I haven't. There's a barrel on the other side of that tree. Open it up and get the honey jars. And then you just like tap, click on it. So, get a bottle, put it in my hand, and then just click the the honeycomb. Yeah, I I right click it. You know, however you. Yeah, there we go. Up. It's a honey bottle. Mm -hmm. Right on. <laughs> when you have four honey bottles, you can turn it into a honey block. I'm almost to level 30. What are you doing, fishing? I should be, huh? <laughs> no, I'm hitting skeletons. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> because skeletons hold bows. The, the, <coughs> you get more experience on the mob that 
holds a weapon, and because they are holding bows, always, then you're always getting experience off them. Oh, you have a lot of chickens just sort of trapped in a corner out here, eh? Oh, I know. It's like my own private chicken farm. Oh, I just came near it and it gave me 15 eggs. <laughs> wow. <laughs> go, go in my house and throw them. Or go throw them in the honey, in the bee habitat. Oh, uh, I'll just, I'll put them in a chest. I'll find an appropriate I chest should, for you. I should kill them, I guess. Because they're just clogging up the system there. I just need to hit like 10 more skeletons. Yeah, I'll put this in your cook chicken uh, chest up here. There yeah, we go. That's where all my chicken products are. I'm, I'm just gonna go to adjust chatting kind of mode here. Hang out with you guys a little bit. Just like that. Yeah. So good times, guys. I am gonna have to end the stream pretty soon. Um, been, I got a, I got a whole bunch of things to do today. I'd very much like to do something with my uh, youngest one today. So, I'm gonna plan some sort of activity to do. You know, it's the March break as we have here in uh, Canada, right? Uh, maybe the March break doesn't exist in other Hello. countries. I don't know. Hello. Hi. Oh. Um, hey, hey. Right uh, now, I'm, right now I'm working, but I can chat with you guys while I'm working. That's fine. Right on. Right on. I got my headset on, so it makes it easier. You're an air, so, you're, you're an air traffic controller, are you? So it doesn't matter if you... <laughs> a, a, a bovine traffic controller. A bo exactly, a bovine traffic controller. <laughs> okay, I got level 30. Amazing. So, so what I was saying in the chat is Maddie can take you to my base through the... And Oh, I think we lost you there. I did too, but I heard him say, take you to his base, and maybe... Oh, never. Yeah, we'll, we'll go, go through, through the nether. nether, yeah. Actually, well, I, I do have to check out pretty soon, guys. Uh, I basically had about an hour to stream, and it's coming close to that now. But I would definitely like to do that soon. Madi, your, your skin is awesome. It's really well done. Thank you. Look at it. It looks great. I think it was a free one. I, I well, got. just really nice textures, yeah. and it's been designed really well. Minecraft. I yeah, I have that. I have that pack. It wasn't. I don't think it was that long ago that it was released. Really like last week or something. Yeah, yeah, and it you came out. With How do I look in my armor here? No more leather jacket. Look okay. You look so shiny. I'm so shiny. There we go. So that's what the full suit okay. looks like, eh? That's what the full suit looks like. Thank you. Can you guys hear me now? Yeah, there you are. There you are. There we are. Ah. Jazz is asking, oh, yeah. Maddie, Jazz is asking how to set up and use the skeleton spawner. So, do you think we can just pop downstairs to show her really quick? She'd love to see it. Let's just go down and have a quick look at it. I replaced the whole floor with path dice, so it's more faster and efficient. So, oh, right on. Yeah. Good job. That was there. Yeah. I am right to the today. There we go. Okay, so first thing oh, when you find the spawner, you have to dig a you have to dig all around it. And I used to dig I usually dig the top part first and then I dig the bottom part. And I go like four up from the top. You put a block on top of the spawner because theoretically they're not supposed to be able to um, appear on top of this uh, on top of a half slab but I often see skeletons up there so I don't know if they appear and then drop down um, I put the glass here just so we could see it actually oh yeah I totally want to see it in action here and it's amazing then so they're falling in that hole down there yeah they're, they're, they're four, four spaces from the spawner to the wall four spaces I think from the top to the ceiling 
and three from the bottom to the floor. Then we filled it full of packed ice and you leave two holes at the bottom, one right underneath and one above it. You put two signs, you put a sign directly on the block underneath it and the one next to that. That stops the water from flowing in into it. They fall into it, but the water doesn't fall into it because the sign stops it. Right, okay. And then the one sign oh, that and here he comes. up, Not that does. kind of stops them. Um, that stops the water too. It, it, it works. It works. I don't know why it works, but it works. Then there are seven, seven blocks from the bottom pole to the chute where they are right here. Seven blocks up. And you put a piece of soul sand down at the bottom. And you and I went up about 22-ish. Up there, okay. Uh huh. And then I went over six at the top. And he put ice there. You can see that up in my um, enchanting room. It just happened to end up in my enchanting room. Yeah, yeah. So I, I'm actually going to go back up there. Your, in your spider place. Hey, Taco, go stand by the um, skeleton so that skeletons will form and she can see them walk across that little path. There. You see, Jez? Miku's asking if you can make it bigger, Madi. Do you think it could be larger than you made it? Like, yeah, there he goes. Or wider, yeah. But it also doesn't improve the spawn rate, so there's really no point in yeah. um, making it bigger. It's just more. I mean, if it improved the spawn rate of the skeletons. It'd be more worth it, but it's unfortunate. Yeah, so wouldn't be worth it. There's a sign right there so that so it stops the water, and then the skeletons will fall down with no water. Right. Okay. I always put little messages on mine, so if you walked over so there, you see that. Read so it. Don't look down. Yeah. <laughs> Something quite funny happened to me when I was putting packed dice in there. I had just farmed out 30 levels to enchant my pickaxe. Uh -oh. And then I died while putting pack ice all 30 levels. Oh, no. oh. oh. oh Jazz. This took me forever. She can find him on YouTube. She can find all of these on YouTube. So then they come down and they fall here. You don't want to make them fall any more than 21 is like the max. Because that 22 and they and die when they hit the bottom. Yeah, so you just want to hurt them, right? Yeah, that's, that's right. The thing you just want to hurt them, hurt them as much as you can, so that now I should be able to hit them with anything and they just, they'll die. The, the awesome thing, thing is, is, um, is I, I, sorry. no, go ahead, no, go ahead. I, I was just gonna say the only thing is when they're uh, more than one, like the one will shoot the other and then it'll die when it hits. Oh, yeah, yeah. that happens. That's not friendship. No, <laughs> Brett, that was not friendship is power. <laughs> I usually take off all my armor because sometimes if you're like trying to heal a weapon, if I have my mending armor on, it might sometimes suck. Even though it's mended, it still will suck some of the experience. So, so, keep the you, armor don't have, so you don't have to hold the armor on for the mending to work? No, so you can wear no the if it's already mended. Then I yeah. Armor, armor, armor has mended, but as long as you have it on, then yeah, it'll work. But if you, but you'll be okay. getting shot sometimes, so it'll kind of still. No, my thought is sometimes even if it's fully mended, yeah. the experience yeah. will maybe sometimes go into that, and I don't want it to, so I take it off, so that I know the experience is going yeah. either to me or to whatever I, a weapon I'm trying to heal. Like right now, I'm trying to heal my shovel. So I'll go to my sword and I'll hit him with my sword, but then I'll hurry and click to my shovel. All right, we're gonna hit mute on the on it. mute on this just to be able to talk with I you guys. Feel. Jazz, it is really I just cool. Beat him with the Isn't it great? I know it takes a little bit of durability, um, but with the experience, you can so yeah, I do have to check out, guys. Uh, well, my, totally my appreciate you guys uh, popping three. in today. It's great to see, hear from everybody. So uh, yeah, glad everybody's doing three, well. But we don't really need any of this. Uh, I'll be back uh, soon yeah, tomorrow, uh, same time. Uh, is usually what I aim for. You know what I mean? So if you guys got something to tell me, something to show me, you want to take some screenshots and send them to me. You know how to do it. Just on the Facebook page, you can you can private message there. Within 
the Discord, we have a screenshot screenshot <laughs> section that you can go ahead and post all, you know, showcase all your stuff, show it off. I want to see all your builds. I want to see what it's all about. So, um, yeah, Jess. Uh, another another thing is that uh, you can always you can always just join the chat. Uh, some of the um. Some of the chat things are for say, the stream only, and some of them are just to of, hang um, out. Uh, you know what I mean? So uh, I think you should you be able to listen. A, hey, like Hannah. A, like a super smelter, small one. And oh, you can just Hannah, put that's terrible news. And it automatically dispenses into the hopper and doesn't, you don't have Pop to have into the realm if you can. These guys the would want to know that. Hold on, I'm just going to give them the bad oh, news. Oh, yeah. oh yeah, Hannah. Yeah, that way you don't have to have two furnaces. Yeah, hey idea. guys. I'll do that for the next time. Yeah. H Hannah just popped into the Facebook chat there saying that she's going to come on in a little bit, uh, but she's uh, not feeling well. She's been diagnosed with food poisoning, she says. Oh, yeah, it's so rough, you know? That sucks. Oh. Uh, let's, let us heal you. Come come to the realm. <laughs> come play with some the Minecraft. Power of positivity. <laughs> with the power of positivity. <laughs> with the power of positivity. We all feel horrible for her. Oh. <laughs> Well, if you need some yes, friendship, you know where to go. I hear his cows. <laughs> yeah, for sure. So listen, guys, I got to I, I got to log off the stream. I got to log off the realm. Uh, thanks very much for playing with me today, guys. It's always great to play with you. And uh, yeah, I've had some good times. Thank you for the help, Maddie. I have a piece of armor that uh, means something now. So. <laughs> I'll work on the other pieces for you because I have diamonds. Oh, I got. I, I can. I can replace any diamonds you use. Okay, I have like okay. twenty-two of them. So. Um, Perfect. Yeah, I'm going to use that mending thing on the chest armor there uh, and just sort of get started with that and we'll see how it goes. Uh, but once I'm tough, I know I can go out into the world. Uh, right now, I literally had a gold hat and gold boots and that was it. <laughs> so that's not cool. <laughs> I'm not just going to start roaming around wearing that, you know. Someone just gave me full diamond armor with full enchantments on it and... I was like, well, you didn't oh. have to give me this, but they were like, it's a spare, you can have it. I was like, oh my god. <laughs> like, was that surrealistic? Was yeah. that surrealistic? He is so generous. Yeah. He just gave, gave me a full suit and a chest at the moment because I don't want to die with it on. Hey, now, if you want to come see my house, there's not much to look at. You go see Madi's house, you go but see it's, it's, Taco's house. Uh, awesome. Bruce says he's got a nice little thing going on right now. You should do a little tour of the uh, Lifestyles of the Rich and Famous. You might like what you see. I'm just still getting my stuff together. I still don't have a roof on my house, really, so... If you ever get the chance, you should go check out. Got me a new room, and I'm working on something really cool in there. It's called an autumn... Just going to disconnect from that. Thanks very much for popping by, guys. Um, this is the first Twitch affiliate stream, and I uh, totally appreciate you guys tolerating an ad occasionally and things like that. So it will support the stream, uh, and it will sort of help uh, float the bills or whatever happens to come by around here, you know what I mean? Uh, I will be seeing you guys soon. Hannah, take care of yourself, please. Alex, get some sleep. <laughs> Hopefully we'll see. Uh, oh, and uh, Royal, thanks for the sub, man. Totally appreciated that. Uh, I'm going to I'm going to drop some bits on you <laughs> as a thank you. <laughs> we'll figure out the Twitch affiliate thing soon, guys. There's going to be sort of special badges and emotes and uh, all kinds of sort of fun Twitch platform stuff that you can do if you're a subscriber, if you can do if you're if you're just a, a viewer but you feel like interacting a little bit more, you can spend a couple bits and little weird things uh, little weird and fun things basically. So that's all open to us now. This is the very first affiliate stream. Uh, I feel it's been a huge success. Oh. Thanks very much, guys. <laughs> I'll see you all soon. So take care. And uh, yeah, ciao for